So when opening a bottle of wine, have you ever ended up with a little bit of cork in your glass? <laughs> or, or actually the entire cork in your bottle? Most of the time that has to do with how you're opening the bottle or what you're using to open the bottle. In this video, we're going to learn about the primary kinds of corkscrews so that you can make an informed decision on what to get. It seems like there are dozens of different kinds of corkscrews. There are so many kinds out there and you really don't know which one to use. It can get pretty confusing. We're going to cut through the clutter and look at the three most prevalent types of openers. The winged opener, the lever or rabbit opener, and the waiter's helper, also known as the waiter's friend. By the end of this video, you'll know all you need to know to make a decision on what corkscrew you want to use. When it comes to a a corkscrew, one key element to consider is whether or not the corkscrew has an auger screw, which has a solid core, or the more common spiral or one that looks like a curly cue. The main reason I point this out is that there is a tendency for a solid auger to push flex of cork into your bottle of wine. The worm, on the other hand, tends to be a lot cleaner. I prefer to use the, the corkscrew with a worm versus an auger. Now let's take a look at the different kind of corkscrews. The first one is the winged opener. It's made up of the bottle opener, which you can open a bottle of beer or a glass or a bottle of uh, soda, the handle, the lever or wings, the body, and the screw or auger. This opener is pretty easy to use. This is possibly the most popular. They can be either very plain or very elaborate. Regardless of the cost or outward appearance, they all do essentially the same thing. By the way, a word to the wise, don't get a cheap one. The cheap ones have a tendency to break pretty easily. The second opener I'm showing you is the rabbit or lever style, possibly the easiest to use. Uh, the reason it's called a rabbit opener is that it looks like a rabbit. See the eyes, the ears, the body that looks sort of like it's running. The fact of the matter is, I can't see a rabbit in this thing. Do you see Bugs Bunny? I, I don't see Bugs Bunny. I still call it a rabbit corkscrew. But the reality is, you need a pretty vivid imagination to see a rabbit in this thing. As far as seeing the different parts of the rabbit, you have the handles, the worm, and the lever. This is very simple and easy to use. It's fast, easy, and will last for years. This will make your wine drinking fun and easy. The third corkscrew is the waiter's helper or waiter's friend. This is the traditional opener for people that work in the wine business. Uh, there's a single pull and a double pull helper and I'm showing double pull primarily, primarily because it's, to me, a lot easier to use. The double pull is also known as the double hinge. The elements or parts of the waiter's helper are the handle or lever, the boot lever, and you see there's two notches that this is what would make the uh, double, double hinge. The foil cutter, and the spiral or the worm. Remember, these are all waiter's helpers. There, there's different shapes and designs. There's different shapes and designs in the handles, in the boots or the boot levers, uh, and in the foil cutters. You'll notice that the foil cutters, these foil cutters are completely different. Very easy to use, by the way. They all look a little bit different, but they do exactly the same thing. They open your bottle of wine. So, out of all the corkscrews on the market, the three that we showed are the most popular styles and extremely easy to use. This will give you a good jump start on determining which corkscrew is best suited for you. And if you need a corkscrew, don't forget to click the link below. There are over 20 corkscrews to select from. Well, there you have it. Everything you need to know about the types of wine bottle openers or also known as corkscrews. For more help on how to use these corkscrews, check out my video, How to Open a Bottle of Wine Properly. There I go into a step-by-step -step details on how to open a bottle of wine. 
If you like this video or have any more questions, let me know in the comments below and subscribe and click the little bell to turn on the notifications to make sure you never miss out on any of these weekly tips. Folks, I'm here to help and serve you as we learn more about wine together. Thank you.